Hello, Tactuas here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to add a color to swatches in Adobe Illustrator. So without further ado, let's get right into it. As you can see, I have created a new Illustrator document and I have created a shape right here with a red color. Let's say we want to add this color to our swatches. We can actually do that in a few easy steps. So the first thing you want to do is to actually find the color you would like to add to the swatches. So you can find the color by going to the swatches panel right here. If you cannot see this, you can find it in window. And if you go down to color right here. And from here, you can just pick any color you would like to use. And I have just chosen this red color. So when you have chosen your color, we are now actually ready to add it to the swatches. So to do that, we first want to open our swatches panel. And you can find that in window. And if you go down right here, where it says swatches, and press on it. And as you can see, we will now get this swatches panel right here. And there is a lot of different swatches already. If you don't want to see them, we can just press on these three lines right here. Choose select all unused. And we can actually just delete them. Just like this. So we can actually just select our shape where we have used our red color. And then go into our swatches panel again and press on this new swatch. You can see this little icon right here. As you can see, this new swatch will now appear and you can just set it to RGB or CMYK, whatever you would like to use, depending on what you're creating. And then just press OK. And as you can see, we have now our red swatch in our swatches panel. And if you try to create some new shapes right here with no fill and stroke, we can just create some shapes right here. If we then select both of the shapes and try to apply the new swatch we have just created, you can see that it is now the exact same color as we just saved. And the cool thing about using swatches is that we can always change the color one place instead of going through all of the different shapes and changing them individually. So instead of just selecting all of our red shapes, and let's say we had a hundred red shapes, this can take quite some time. So because we actually created a swatch, we can just go into our swatches panel again, double click on our swatch we have just created, and the swatch option panel will appear again. And from here we can actually just choose another color. Let's say we want a more yellow color, something like this. Make sure to turn on preview so we can see the changes. And if you press OK, and as you can see, we have now changed our swatch. So all of the shapes that we have been applying this swatch has now been changed. And if you want it back to the red color, we can just double click again. Change the color and press OK. And it is now back to where we started. So yeah, that is actually how to add a color to the swatches. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. That was all for now. See you in the next one.